Hi, I'm Abby. My only child, my son, Darius, has Phelan McDermott syndrome. The toughest part of this diagnosis for us has been experiencing regression. Despite Darius's genetic diagnosis, he was doing quite well. Oh. At age two, Darius was able to put silverware away. Notice here, when he's done putting away the first batch, he says, more, as he returns to get more. No. Darius could also feed himself with a spoon. At three, Darius could drink water from a regular cup without spilling. <laughs> You're so silly. Ooh. And he was pretty great at shooting a basketball. Yay! Good job, buddy! But sadly, one by one, Darius's skills and interests and all the potential he had in life were robbed from him. Around the age of six is when all these skills began to vanish. Where does the spoon go? Where does the spoon go? No, try again. The spoon, no, you have to use your eyes. You have to use your eyes to look. Good job. Oh, buddy. Can I have the cup? Can you swallow what's in your mouth? Can I have the cup, Darius? Can I have the cup? Additionally, he craves motion, even if it's not productive, like pacing back and forth in the house with no particular rhyme or reason. Although we're unable to pinpoint any specific event that may have happened or caused this regression, it happened and it's heartbreaking. I was driven to join in the formation of Kier Shank with other similarly situated parents with one goal in mind, to accelerate research, to help my son Darius and all others that suffer with this dreadful condition, a chance for a brighter tomorrow. <laughs>